Alright guys, welcome back. Today I'm doing a quick video about Renegade Raider because there is the new Blaze skin, which is basically like a molten Renegade Raider, but it's a completely separate skin. And I just kind of wanted to talk about it and just talk about Renegade Raider in Fortnite. And before I start this, I know people are going to be asking, why the hell are you uploading like 7 or 8 videos in one day? And it's because there's just a lot to upload about right now, and I'm going to be leaving for like 8 days, so I just, I want to pump out a lot of content today, just so, um, alright, someone, I just got a notification, but anyways, so, uh, yeah, so we're just going to be talking about Ryan Gatorader and the Blaze skin, but the problem is, is that uh, there's just a lot of videos and I just I want to be clear of like all video ideas by the time I get back from this trip anyways anyways it's a new skin blaze or molten renegade raider it was teased in the trailer and as soon as it was in the trailer everyone knew that people are gonna be clickbaiting it, and they did and well, everyone was saying that renegade raider was gonna return and here's the reason why renegade raider cannot return Renegade Raider was in something called the Seasonal Shop in Season 1. And in the Seasonal Shop, basically, you would need to get to a certain level in Season 1 to be able to unlock certain items. Now, the reason why Recon, ex uh, Recon Expert, Recon Specialist, I forgot what her name is. The reason why she was able to be re-released and Skull Trooper and Ghoul Trooper was actually because they were... Um, they were not in the seasonal shop. They were just like featured items from season one. They weren't actually in this like seasonal shop, which kind of acted like the battle pass, but not really the battle pass. And in season eight, or maybe in the beginning of season nine, I forgot, but it was like when we got those styles for a whole bunch of OG skins, uh, we got the styles for a whole bunch of season three skins, and there was a new style that with like a checkered pattern that was added to Renegade Raider that looks really cool. And around that time, Epic made a statement that Renegade Raider, in its original form, would not be coming back. Um, but they said Renegade Raider, like the OG style of Renegade Raider, would not return. So, I guess a lot of people thought that this new checkered style was going to return. Or, like, this new checkered style of Renegade Raider was going to be, like, a, a skin that um, was going to be in the item shop. But, you know, people that got it that were not OGs wouldn't be able to have the OG variant. But anyways, obviously that got OG scared, and me, in terms of, like, OG skins coming back, my opinion is Epic Games usually does a good job with it. Like, having OG styles, um, to make the players that have those skins still, you know, show off their OG-ness, I think that's fine. But, you know, there's a lot of skins that unfortunately came back without OG styles, and that's kind of sad. You know, Recon Expert, um, the Christmas skins, I don't know any of the Christmas skins that had, um, OG variants, um, but honestly, you know, the, the ones really high up the list, you know, Skull Trooper, um, Ghoul Trooper Recon Expert, they all have OG styles that are super rare, but the thing is, is that, um, in a way, Renegade Raider's almost like a equivalent of, like, a Battle Pass skin, so it's not coming back, and Epic Games said that the style, or, like, OG Renegade Raider will never come back, sort of implying that they were going to make a new variant, and this is something I'm surprised a lot of people aren't talking about, because they said that around the end of Season 8, beginning of Season 9, and that was the same time where we got that Jonesy trailer, like the Jonesy on the island or whatever, and a lot of people are saying that that is hinting towards this season, so that some of the things this season were actually planned back then, um, now, one thing Epic Games has revealed, or, like, someone at Epic Games revealed that, like, they're not actually working on the game super far ahead, but I'm sure they've planned, they, they make plans for the game super far ahead, and basically, I'm sure this plan was made all the way back then, so I, I, I find that pretty cool. One thing I really hated to see is that even though, like, the leakers made it clear that Blaze was a separate skin, Everyone was saying that Renegade Raider was returning and that Blaze was going to be like an OG style or like a new style that would be coming out with Renegade Raider's return. And like, it's so stupid. Like, um, 
Uh, I watch this guy, Happy Power, because he just does leaks and stuff. But I'd rather watch other people or get the leaks directly from Twitter at this point. Because now I'm starting to realize that he kind of farms views, I guess. Literally, like, in one of his ti like in his videos, he's always saying, Some happy news and some bad news. Renegade Raider, it, um, like, there's the Blaze skin, which also hints that Renegade Raider might be coming back. That's happy news for some, sad news for others. I'm like, Renegade Raider's not coming back at all. So can you please stop freaking lying to people, like... And then in thumbnail, it showed the blaze skin. It's like, Renegade returning. It's like, literally all the leaks, like, all the leaks, uh, leaker sources said, like, like, Hypex and Fire Monkey, they all said, um, they, like, they made it very clear that Blaze is a completely different skin, not a style, and that Renegade was not returning. But, like, this guy literally ignores the leakers, like, his sources. Like, he literally reports on all the other leaks, but as soon as they said something that might, like... Um, I guess be a little less dramatic. I don't know. I'm not t trying to attack like certain youtubers because it wasn't just him It was like a whole bunch of people that did this Obviously a lot of people right now since blaze is in the shop are saying renegade raider is back and probably I'll get the skin because Renegade Raider while it's not the coolest looking skin out of the OG skins in my opinion I think it looks the coolest trust me even if actual renegade raider came back in the shop. I would not get it unless I actually thought it looked cool. Like, Recon Expert could have gotten her, didn't, because I don't think she looks cool, you know? And I knew... The, the only reason why that skin is cool is because she's super rare. But obviously, you know, whatever. I, I didn't get her because she just doesn't look cool. <laughs> um, Renegade Raider does look cool. So, I... Uh, and especially this fire variant fits my channel well, you know, Phoenix production, so... Hopefully this will be the last skin I actually buy until the next Battle Pass. If you're wondering why am I such a Battle Pass boy, I find um, item shop skins usually a waste of money. But I'll grab this Molten uh, Renegade skin, and to be honest, I think I'll be good until um, next Battle Pass. Because I uh, I don't really like spending too much money on uh, item shop skins. Um, but apparently there's going to be a default bundle coming out like an OG default bundle and if that happens I'll be completely stoked but anyways I just I I was really mad seeing all this clickbait and I really wanted to do a video on it I was gonna make it um a little while ago but I just never got the chance um but yeah you know I just I don't like seeing clickbait in this community it's been happening since the beginning but especially now you know I, I thought we've come far enough um, as a Fortnite community, but anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and, uh, I will be going live soon, and, uh, ooh, there's a lot of videos, and, um, crap, you know, this is only the second last video for today, because there's this, the Fortnite stream, and then tomorrow, actually, today I need to up, I need to edit, um, like, some videos for tomorrow, because tomorrow I'm uploading four videos, and I know that's crazy, um, doing my 420 subscriber special, even though, like, when I filmed it, we were at, like, 428, now we're at 431, so thank you guys, um, but, you know, 420 is still, you know, the quote, funny number that a lot of people say it is, you know, on the internet, so I, uh, I made it, I filmed the Try Not To Laugh for that, so, there's that, and then I'll have two Minecraft videos, and sort of just a announcement video about my eight-day hiatus, I will be starting uh, on Monday. Alright, I'll see you guys later. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Enjoy this new skin because it's cool. And one thing I forgot to say, oh my god, I knew I was going to forget something. I know for a fact OGs that have Renegade Raider are going to be mad at this skin. Even though the skin isn't even Renegade Raider. The skin is not the return of Renegade Raider. It's not taking any rarity away from Renegade Raider. But whatever, OGs kind of like... The ones that are... You know, the ones that aren't even happy about OG styles, or like, if a skin looks like an OG skin, they get mad. Those are the OGs I don't like. The OGs that are, that are, you know what? You know, cool, there's an OG style to the skin, it's re-released, or... You know, I, I just, I find it stupid, because it happens a lot where OGs literally get mad if a skin looks like an OG skin. I'm like, it's not taking rarity away from it. But anyways, I'll see you guys later. 
enjoy the skin because it is looking pretty cool. All right, see you guys.